What is up, Geek Army? This is Kiernan with GeeksWithGames.com, and we are going to do a Let's Play of Bioshock Infinite. Now, I have played all through just Chapter 1 to test my settings, test my video recording, make sure everything's smooth as butter for you guys. And that is all I've played, so I figured with the Bioshock series, they're full of some nice twists. Um, some interesting gameplay ought to develop with a blind run. I thought it might be kind of fun for you guys to watch. Um, I'm also a little bit of a wussy, so <laughs> I'm expecting to get uh, a little bit freaked out. And uh, you guys can experience that live. Um, I have opted to leave subtitles on uh, for your guys' sake as viewers, so let me know in comments if you are okay with me turning those off, because it's obviously a more cinematic experience without. Um, minor spoiler here, you can see I've only played through to the second chapter. Uh, and I think I'm going to play on medium, due to... I just don't want to die a bunch, because um, that doesn't make it very fun to watch, so I'd rather this be more of a cinematic and interesting experience. Normally I would play on hard um, if I was doing this solo. So without further ado, let's check out Bioshock Infinite. That cute little logo got scary fast. Booker, are you afraid of God? No. I'm afraid of you. The mind of the subject will desperately struggle to create memories where none exist. Barriers to trans-dimensional travel. 1889. 1912, coast of Maine. Are you going to just sit there? As compared to what? Standing? Not standing. Rowing. Rowing? Have you planned on it? So you expect me to shoulder the this? burden? No. I do expect you to do all the rowing. And why is that? Coming here was your idea. My idea? I made it very clear that I don't believe in the exercise. The rowing? No. Imagine that's wonderful exercise. Then what? The entire thought experiment. Excuse me. How much longer? One goes into an experiment knowing one could fail. But one does not undertake an experiment knowing one has failed. Can we get back to the rowing? I suggest you do, no, but we're never going to get there. No, I mean I'd greatly appreciate it if you would assist. Perhaps you should ask him. I imagine he has a greater interest in getting there than I do. I suppose he does, but there's no point in asking. Why not? Because he doesn't row. He doesn't row? No, he doesn't row. Ah, I see what you mean. We've arrived. Looks familiar. Shall we tell him when we'll be returning? Would that change anything? It might give him some comfort. Well, at least that's something we can agree on. Hey! Somebody meeting me here? I'd certainly hope so. It does seem like a dreadful place to be stranded. Well, maybe there's someone inside. Well, that's a comforting situation to be in. Silver Eagle. Looks like that's what they call their coins. In Bioshock Infinite. Now, I will say, I am somewhat of an exploratory gamer. Um, I won't take too much time doing that, but I do like to kind of see some of the side stuff, some of the secrets, uh, little fun details that really flesh out the experience. Oh, hello. DeWitt, bring us the girl and wipe away the debt. This is your last chance. The blood. Excuse on the note. me. It's Booker DeWitt. Uh, I guess you're expecting me? So, we'll try and examine the details, maybe make some guesses as to the plot. Uh, this game had an ungodly amount of hype, build up, tons of trailers, and I managed to avoid the vast majority of it, so I really don't know what's going on in the storyline. Um, so I think that would be kind of fun if I kind of talked through it and made some guesses. Um, that being said, I have no idea what those two were talking about. 
he doesn't row. I'm not sure if that meant he doesn't know. I don't know. Your guess is as good as mine. Let's do this. Of thy sins shall I wash thee. So this is kind of a Catholic reference, I think. Good luck with that, pal. And it looks like Booker DeWitt is a skeptic. Let's see what we got in this lighthouse. Eat jar of pickles plus health. Jar of pickles are healthy. Can of beans plus health. Now I'm not positive, but I don't think there's some sort of inventory. I assume that heals you right then. From Sodom shall I lead thee. That is of Sodom and Gomorrah fame, the two cities. Anyone here? Hello? Two cities burned down by God for their sinfulness in the Old Testament. So lead us out of sin, I'm guessing. Let's see what we have here. Cereal. <laughs> nice little display here. Columbia, condensed schedule. Got a map. We are in Maine up there, so we're in the upper right. Be prepared. He's on his way. You must stop him. See. Who that is. And it looks like it passes all the way to Arizona and comes back around. I'm not sure exactly which direction is forward and which is back. So, please tell us. Hello? Hello? It's not going to get us anywhere. Alright, look, there's no one around. We can do some bed jumping. Woohoo, woohoo, woohoo! Oh. Blood and a mess. It's significantly less nice looking than the rest of this room, eh? Use the sink. Doesn't look like it does anything. There's some dishes to be done. Eat oats, drink coffee plus salt. I'm not sure what that is. Fascinating though. To thine own land shall I take thee. So we're being led from Sodom to our land, from sin, out of sin. Lots of blood. That's promising. Okay, here we go. That's... Shit. That is a good way to put it, Booker. Don't disappoint us, or you will get shot through the head. We might as well take the money. This guy doesn't need it, huh? No, we're not too far off the coast, it looks like. Somebody did some damage to that window. In New Eden soil shall I plant thee. Going from sin to New Eden, whatever that is. Eden, obviously, is the biblical garden of perfection. Oh. These bells marked with the same little symbols as that note earlier. Hey man, that card. There is. He got that awful fast. Two... Two swords. Mm. What in the world is... Alright. Now this is totally close encounters in the third kind mode. Crazy. Got some. Might as well loot while we're contacting the aliens. Pretty sweet sound effects, I gotta say. What do we have going on here? Pretty legit. All right. Looks like they expect me to sit in their fancy chair. Kind of fun how it starts in a lighthouse, similar to Bioshock, the original. Go. Make yourself ready, Pilgrim. The bindings are there as a safeguard. Safeguard from what? I'm a pilgrim. That's exciting. Oh. 
There goes my gun into the rockets. Assumption in the count of five. Count of four. No, no. Three. Two. One. Ascension. Ascension. Five thousand. That would not be freaky at all in 1912. Hallelujah. Hello. Yeah, good call, Booker. What indeed? Or what? Lens flare. Thank you, JJ Abrams. Father Comstock, our prophet. Fascinating. Where are we headed? Why would he send his savior unto us? If we will not raise a finger for our own salvation. And though we deserved not his mercy, he has led us to this new Eden. A last chance for redemption. I like redemption, but I don't know how I feel about this forced redemption. I don't know, maybe my character wanted to come here, I'm not sure. It doesn't seem like he wanted to, though. And the prophet shall lead the people to the new, which is apparently the city in the sky we're in. Alright, let's loosen up. I wonder if Booker DeWitt would have any pressure issues to find a way into the city. Maybe he's got a nosebleed. Press N to help navigate. No thank you. Look at that. I do enjoy the lighting. This, this is the Unreal Engine. It's really come a long way. The seed of the prophet shall sit the throne and drown in flame the mountains of man. Welcome center. This is not good on shoes. Not very Excuse welcoming. Me. Where am I? Heaven, friend. Or as close as we'll see till judgment day. Huh. The lamb, the future of our city. Let's keep such questions to myself, unless I want to get made. Oh, so they'll discover what he's up to. As well, loot these crazies. You guys are cynic anyway, right? Prayer stalls, I'm guessing. Very churchy and bad on shoes. Silver eagles. Oh, don't want to leave any behind for the prophet? Looks like he's got plenty to spare. Look at this. This is gorgeous. Not a, not a big fan of the Catholic art style normally in real life, but this is pretty awesome. And in my womb shall grow the seed of the prophet. That sounds like fun. The seed of the prophet. <laughs> I wonder if that implies literally that the prophet is passing a seed along to everybody. Maybe Booker got that. I'm not sure if that's what this little <laughs> was about. Voxophone. It's a fancy looking contraption. Oh, look at that. Love the prophet because he loves the sinner. Lady Comstock. I love the sinner because he is you. 
without the sinner, what need is there for a redeemer? And without sin, what grace has forgiveness? So this is all Lady Comstock. Maybe she's just the one who has to... Maybe she's a Mary figure or something. Fascinating. Oops, this is the wrong way. I'm getting some religious overtones from this game so far. I don't know about you guys. I think it might be a theme. What do you think, buddy? Religious? Or just, you like robes? That's cool, too. No judging. No judging. Look at this fascinating staircase. I wonder if erosion is an issue. Oh, oh, we're missing... Missing details. Is that the... The gladium? These are the three symbols, it looks like. Clavum. And volumen. This must be Latin for... Sword, key, and paper. Ooh. And every year, on this day of days, we recommit ourselves to our city and to our prophet, Father Constant. We recommit through sacrifice and the giving of thanks and by submerging ourselves in the sweet waters of baptism. And lo, if the prophet has struck down our enemies at the end me, and not railed against the Sodom beneath us, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just railed against the Sodom beneath us, but not accepted the three golden gifts of the founders, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just accepted the three golden gifts of the founders, and not prayed for our deliverance, it would have been enough. If the prophet had only prayed for our deliverance and not led us to this new Eden, it would ifs. have been enough. If the prophet had just led us to the new Eden and not purged the vipers of the Orient, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just purged the vipers of the Orient, but not suffered the sacrifice of his beloved, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just suffered the sacrifice of his All right, I wonder how that one this goes. the Vox Populi, it would have been enough! Huh, that's a lot of information. Okay, so Father Comstock is the prophet, and that was Lady Comstock back there. Ooh, what else did we get out of that? Uh, he did a lot of things for them, led them to here, accepted some gifts. Let somebody die, I think? His beloved? All of that would have been enough, but he did so much more for these people, apparently. Is it someone new? Someone from the Sodom below? Oh, he fought you and wounded me. Columbia, which I think we learned me. Booker did also. Our founders and our lord. I just need passage into the city. Passage to the city. Brother, the only way to Columbia is through rebirth in the sweet waters of baptism. Will you be cleansed, brother? Let's get at this or turn around and get back on that rocket. Might as well get it over with. Alright, that's what I was thinking, Booker. Hey. I baptize you in the name of our prophet, in the name of our founders, and the name of our Lord. Sounds good, Booker. <laughs> I don't know, brothers and sisters, but this one doesn't look clean to me. Bosom of Columbia. So Columbia is the city, and that must be its travel map we saw earlier. I'm guessing. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Who's there? Bring us the curb and wipe away the debt. What do you want? We had a deal to it. Open this door right now. I told you, I'm not gonna do it. Go away! Mr. DeWitt! Mr. DeWitt! Alright, so DeWitt's got a badge. He's got a racing gambling addiction. And he's into cigs and booze. And he's kind of a slob. And he owes a debt. Big debt, probably due to that gambling. Whoa, hello. Airship attack. <laughs> no. 
Hey, founding father statues there, creepy. That idiot priest needs to learn the difference between baptizing a man and drowning one. I need to find a landmark and figure out where the hell I am. Alright, and that is chapter one, and this is exactly as far as I got. So, I have no idea what is going to happen next. Tune in next time. Thanks for watching. Defiance is a third-person shooter MMO being developed and released by Tryon Worlds. It's coming out on Windows PC, Xbox 360, and PlayStation 3. Uh, the game